Hello, wild people. We're back with the race to five stars in challenge mode. So, guys, we are going to be just carrying on with the park, seeing if we can make this any more awesome, and just seeing what happens, really. Um, <laughs> hoping and praying that it's gonna work. Uh, so, we're, I just decided, uh, let's build a little, I think let's build a little drinks area and stuff around here. Let's get a little sort of theming here and yeah i think let's see what other things we can bring to the zoo today we're trying to get to five star as quickly as possible obviously hence why it's called the race to five stars but uh we have actually done really well so far so last episode i'll leave a link to that if you didn't see we managed to get some point like some frogs snakes we managed to get some tortoises and some flamingos which was really really cool um let's have a look here yeah, cool. Amazing. Okie dokie. Let's have a look. Oh, they did breed and I didn't realise. And then... And the snakes have bred. I haven't even seen this. I needed the money. So, uh, let's sell all these guys. I can... Wait, you can release these to the wild? That's new. That's a new update on the game. Well, then, let's release them. I did need the money, but... Meh. Um, I'd much prefer to release them to the wild. We need drink profit to be up. We need zoo reputation to be 1.5. Hopefully, we will get there. We're nearly there. We are nearly there. Guest rating, education rating. We need... Happiness rating's great. Marketing isn't great yet, but we'll get there. So, let's put in a load of drink stuff around here for people. Uh, let's put in... A... Oh, information center would be a great idea, actually. <laughs> Whoops. Let's put an information center like right here. Let's put in two information centers actually because it does get quite busy. Let's put in a chief beef. Do I have no money? Yes, I have no money. Oh no. Okay, I have a thousand pounds. This is annoying. Let's put an ATM in over there so people like, can take some money out. And I don't know what other things are going to be good to like get us money. We could probably try and, like, improve our profits a bit. Like, this... Oh, no, that's broken. Great. <laughs> that's great. Okay, let's just increase the price here. Let's make them, like, three quid. That's a bit expensive, but... Eh. Let's sync them all up. Facility's broken. It's always broken. And we're low on cash. Yay! But we have a beautiful enclosure over here. And I'm really chuffed with that. Yeah, we have enough animals. I mean, last episode, we did we did put in a lot of animals, which was cool. There's going to be a drink place here. We'll get some seats and stuff. Put some toilets in. Maybe get another enclosure for an animal. Like, maybe just fit it around here. That would be kind of cool if we can. Oh, my goodness. The greater flamingo is about to have offspring. You're about to have offspring? You don't even know? <laughs> I love the flamingo. I think they're gorgeous. Let's see if it... Why has it got scratches on him? Hmm. I don't know whether I'm happy with this. As you can see, guys, I am recording uh, episode after episode today. Um, so, oh, I don't know why that keeps doing that. There we go. Hmm. Cool. Let's have a look here, then. We have loads of flamingos. You can have up to 500 flamingos. Oh, is it happening? <gasps> it happened! Oh, he's gorgeous. Let's see if it's a girl or a boy. Oh, no, it's not Okay, that's so cute. Okay. We need to sort the enrichment thing out. What are you again? What are you? Are you a boy or a girl? What are you? Oh, it's a little boy and it's a bronze one. So that's great. Woohoo! We got a baby one. That's cute. It's quite big for a baby. I swear the babies are like massive all of a sudden. Don't ask me why. I don't know. Um, yeah. Let's just go check the... Um habitat stuff so great flamingo are there any more toys i don't think we might need to get somebody else in to do some more research yeah because we're currently researching albrea tortoise thingy so uh oh my goodness look at the mess here people people so messy we need just bins everywhere it's in the wrong place okay let's just put some bins like everywhere people are so grubby uh, da -da 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 -da. Let's put some bins. I did put bins all down there, to be fair. Um, <laughs> bins. 
They're the curse of my life. Okay, let's have a look at this. One, two, one, two, three. Okay, and then we probably need bins down here because people are gross. Let's put a bin there as well. I mean, why not? Let's put bins all down here. This is crazy. I shouldn't have to put this many beds in. People, come on. Right, okay, this is great. Uh, let's think about building an enclosure here, actually, today. So, let's... We need a race to five stars. And at the moment, I'm taking too long. Too long. Okay, let's go along here. Gosh, it is a beautiful day today, guys. I'm actually off to Longleat today. Woohoo! I'm super excited. Um, yeah. I'm off to Longleat. The first... I think it was the first... Uh, first place in, like, Europe to have a drive through safari. And especially lions. And actually, Planet Zoo did have inspiration for this. Um, I'm wondering if what we could do eventually is bring the staff path back along here. We could put a path all down the back there, actually, couldn't we? I think that's probably going to be a better idea, actually, just to kind of save space. Let's put in... Yeah, let's do that. So let's put in enclosure all the way down here. Let's put that along there. Let's go path. Let's go kind of a line grid. Let's put one there. That's fine. We can put like drink stands and stuff all down there if not. And then line to grid. I can't actually see this one. <laughs> it's because it's, uh, it's kind of out. Okay, let's go this way. Okay, cool. Fine. That'll do for now. Um, Yeah. Okay, this is going to be one big enclosure for something. We need something again that's going to breed really well. Potentially. <laughs> Hopefully. Maybe something that we can put two animals in one enclosure. We could put... Start putting savannah animals in. But I feel like the last series we did was full of savannah animals. Full of savannah animals. <laughs> I want to want to have loads of different stuff today. Like your tropical animals, really. Okay, let's put a gateway in. We're going to need more staff soon, definitely. Um, okay, we have some money again. So let's go put in some more facilities down here. Um. <laughs> let's go put a gulpy soda in. Cool. Gulpy. Uh, let's put in another... Do we need another information center? don't know. Wow, it's gone in. We gotta be careful of money. Oh my goodness! Look at the money. Oh, gee whiz, gee whiz. Okay, let's put in conservation board <laughs> right there, so people can hopefully get educated. I don't think it's gonna help. <laughs> we'll try though. We'll try though. Um, I don't even know if an education speaker will speak about the environment. Oh no, it won't. Okay, well, there's no point in having that then. Let's undo that. Okay. Um. Hmm, what's the next thing we need to do? We need to put in some benches. Yeah, like I was going to put in some picnic benches around here. You can get nicer picnic benches and stuff like that, but... Just twist them a little bit so they look a little bit more randomised. So people have somewhere to sit. Cool. And then we're going to put bins in the middle. Because people are so messy. People are so messy. Cool. Oh, you can get the restaurant uh, table things. But that's fine. Let's put some vending machines down here. Let's put the gulpy vending machines down here. Cool. There's people coming down here already. That's crazy. Oh, what animal are we going to have in here today? Great to flamingo is about to mate. That's brilliant. We need you guys to get on and mate. <laughs> Let's put glass all down here. And we could put glass down there as well, but, hmm. We could put glass there. Yeah, let's put glass down here. Uh, we need an animal that's not going to worry too much about too many people. I got to one and a half stars. Oh, two stars. Oh, okay. Hmm. Got to try and reduce crime as well. Oh, I don't know what animal to put in. We need something that breeds really, really well. Actually, those pronghorn do breed really well. Hmm. Let's have a look at the size of this enclosure. It's massive. Thing is, uh, we'll definitely do a savannah, but it needs like loads more space for a savannah. We could. I wonder if I could just get something completely outrageous. Hmm. Oh, wolves would be great. Wolves would be really good. They don't breed that great. 
Oh my goodness, a grizzly bear! I mean, I could afford that. Hmm. I don't know what to do. Okay, let's... I wouldn't mind something that's like... You could put lots of something in. Hmm. I'm probably being outrageous. Can I afford lions? Probably not. No? No, oh, Chloe. You cannot afford lions. Oh. Okay, let's have a look at... I don't know. I don't know. I need something that like... Oh, like a ring-tailed lemur would be cool. Oh. There is none of those. What about... Okay, let's just go any species again. Just buy something. Okay. Oh, Indian peafowl. But then they'd have loads of space. Ah, okay. The Indian peafowl are going to get so much space. We've got a male and a female. Let's just look for Indian peafowl. I couldn't actually find it. I have any in the last episode for some reason. I don't know why. Okay. They're going to get a massive enclosure. And they're going to breed like crazy. And it means that uh, there's going to be lots of diseases. <laughs> I think let's get another keeper in, actually. And let's put in another keeper's hut down here. Just keep everyone happy. Let's put another... Re so that's another research center. We also need, like, a watch. Ah, I have no money. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I have no money. My goodness, this is crazy. Underpriced. That's good. Okay, let's take it up to five. Ah, uh, well, let's take it up to eight. Oh, poo. What I done? Let's go up to eight and five. Hopefully that'll work. We could run some marketing, but I've just got to be a little bit careful with money. Animal rating is okay. I bought some peacocks. I mean, they're going to change the world. Let's send to zoo. <laughs> The peacocks are gonna love life in this massive enclosure. I do like making the massive enclosures. I just find it really fun. Okay, that's fine. We've created a little water thingy thing, 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 thing for them. Uh, let's make sure the water's gonna be clean. Uh, it's not gonna be clean. Do I, I don't have the money to not, not make it clean. Oh no. Hmm. It might last if my money goes up. Quickly get a food thing. I think large bowl. I think th I think they eat the same. Oh, okay. Indian peafowl, quick. Indian peafowl. Okay, this is good. Insufficient funds. I can't even buy them. Like I can't buy them anything. Right, quick, get some donation boxes out. I can't even afford that, can I? I don't think I can even afford a donation box. <gasps> 50 quid. Yes. Quick. Quickly. Oh, my goodness. Okay, I've put two donation boxes quickly in. And we have two peafowl. I don't know if... Where are you off, bud? He's like, I'm going. I'm going somewhere. I don't know how many I'm supposed to have. I hope they don't kick off. That'll be great. Um, oh, no, I need four at least. Hmm. Oh, no. Uh, okay, maybe I need to wait. I don't know. My money is going up, so... Let's see what happens. Okay, I need to go to train. I need to go painting. And we need to go... I don't know how much I need of stuff. We need short grass? Short grass. It's whether we have loads of short grass. Woohoo! Okay, we'll just do this. And then we're going to put like loads and loads of soil in, I think. Let's do that. We have so much long grass, apparently. Da, 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 da. Let's put a bit of light soil all around the front here. So it looks like authentic. We'll put like a track in. So it kind of looks like they've been walking the same track. Cool. <laughs> okay, right. Hard shelter. Oh my gosh, I have 300 pounds. That's not too bad. I'm so scared. Okay, quick. Okay, quick, just put that one in. Actually, I really liked what I did with the flamingos, which was put like loads of little ones about. I quite like that. I mean, we could just put a big chunky one in there. Okay, they will be sorted now for forever. Okay. 
actually, that that's kind of a cool idea. I've just come up with an idea, right? Hold the phone. Just come up with an idea. If I put it like right bang in the middle, then what I'm going to do is put... I don't know why I've suddenly just thought of this. Because that's, that's quite cool, their little shelter. And they can get under it because they're so ditty. Um, I'm going to put like a little... Once things are unlocked and stuff, I'm going to put like a little walkway so they can get on top of their enclosure. What's going on now? You're diseased already? Oh, man. This is the problem with peacocks. <laughs> oh, good. Actually, we need to make sure that all our babies have got contraceptive on them because I do not want... I do not want inbreeding. What's wrong with you? You need a staff. Yeah, we do need to put a staff. Do that right, actually. If I have enough money, I'll do that for you. But I don't think I do. No, not yet. Not yet, I don't. Okay. What's this? Toilets cleaned last year. Crazy. Okay. One major thing we need to make sure we have money for, and that is for the clean water thing. And we need to try and get some more peacocks if we can. Oh! Wiggly! I think we can get, like, more than one male as well. Okay, we'll just plop those all in. And see what happens. They're gonna breed. They're gonna breed, guys. They're gonna breed. It's gonna be mad. I think we need some bins over here. I'm paranoid now. Okay. We have £2,000! Yay! We need a clean, like, a water cleaning station. Yeah, because otherwise that's not gonna end well. Put it there. We can put it at the end there. Cool. Oh, that was lucky. Now I can relax. Let's let's sort these guys' enclosure out. So let's uh yeah, I love the bamboo. I love bamboo. It is like my favorite. We'll just put in bamboo like they they are really funny. They make the most silly noises as well. <laughs> let's put some rocks and stuff in. You guys know how much I love rocks. Yeah, I wonder, actually, we could make, like, a stepping stone thing with the rocks. So hopefully they can, like, get up there. So let's, where's that long one gone? Uh, yeah, like, if I can try, there used to be, like, a really long one. Like, this one! Yes! Uh, yeah, like, kind of like that, and then, hmm, has that worked? That has not worked. Um, we need to go advanced for that. Let's go advanced mode, and then... Oh, let's go more advanced mode. Let's go here and then what do I need to do? I need to like kind of do that and then I need to um, and Now I do not know. Oh, no. What have I done? Okay, okay let's go. Let's go like this mm. Let's create a little walkway. That's kind of cute. I don't know whether they'll get up on this one because they are birds after all. I don't know. That's my plan is that they can get up on there and then up onto the top here, which would be kind of cool. Let's see. Mate, he might be doing an example for it. Come on, little guy. <laughs> all the way up now. He might be able to get up there. I don't know. He might be able to get up there. We'll see. Okay. <laughs> I'm enjoying this far too much. Um... Okay, let's just check, see how unhappy they are right now. Oh, this is crazy. Actually, not too bad. This is cool. Okay, let's say so we want Asia. Okay, we don't need Africa. We just need this kind of stuff. Let's put in these bushes. These are really pretty bushes. They, they do like quite a lot of coverage as well, which is great. Um, Yeah, let's put some banana palms in. Let's make this a bit, like, friendlier. We actually have a load of beech trees that I could probably go and use. So, yeah. I do like the bamboo stuff. It's It just looks really cool. I think it looks cool anyway. So let's put in loads of random stuff here. We could put in... More bamboo. Um, oh, too much coverage. Too much coverage, really? That's annoying. Okay, let's delete this massive tree. 
<laughs> such a big enclosure i think they're kind of like swamped but that tree gone is good actually because it means we can put in more stuff so that's good let's put in all these bushes they actually look really nice these ones they kind of fill a lot of the space as well which is good like bracken put little bits of bracken everywhere we do get quite a lot of bracken in the uk actually yeah horses always try to eat it and it's completely poisonous for them put these little tiny bushes in see what happens bramble bush cool the bushes actually make it look really nice let's just put a bramble bush in there and a bramble bush like here maybe yeah, let's put in these little ones. That's a big bramble bush. Okay, it's very random. I'm just putting stuff in and hoping. Hoping for the best. Okay, let's put in more stuff around here, maybe. This is kind of cool. I do like the lily pads. Um, it just makes it look quite nice. Okay. Um, I guess that'll kind of do for now. Oh, I've got to put cherry blossom in got to put a cherry blossom in he's gonna fit another one in uh where should i put that there okay i think that's fine Ooh, what am i doing okay okay Ooh. okay we're doing well i think we're doing well the race to five stars but we need to get like all our boards and stuff up 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 let's put a educator board thing it's not even an educator board it's like an educator stand there and we'll put in glass and we'll need some seeding greater flamingo is about to have some babies that's great cool okay let's put indian peafowl with these these two cool we need loads and loads of conservation boards everywhere 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 you go Conservation boards. Conservation boards. Okay, let's have a look. Woof. This is important. This is what gets people educated. Cool. And then we need speakers. Ooh, hopefully it won't clash with that one. That'd be great. Please don't clash. Put the like them in and just have slightly smaller ones. okay that might work and then we just need a load of these in um we also need to do some vet research we need to see where we're at with those actually i do that last one let's put it more like here um here 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 okay vet has not attended habitat in a very long time oh no why not Let's just come off this second. Why not? Okay, well, I've asked them to go and do that. Okay, that's fine. Ooh, okay, Planet Zoo. You're going to get stressful, I think. But I love it, so don't mind. Okay. Let's do this. <laughs> Their noises they make are just brilliant. I love them. Eco tourism. Okay, let's do this. Oh, it's not a puff adder. It's a peafowl. This is crazy. Help me. Alright, make sure nothing's clashing. Okay, uh, we do kind of need that to cover that one. Um, let's just move it. Let's just move it. Well, we can't move it. Uh, I like to move it, move it. Just move that board actually. Let's just move the board there. Okay, well that's that solved. Um make sure this has got P file. Okay, that's fine. So these people are going to get educated whether they like it or not. That's what's gonna happen. Hopefully. Hopefully that's what's gonna happen. Yeah, the conservation boards though, seriously, they drive me crackers. Education in general just drives me crackers. So we're just gonna put all this in here. This is fun. Do I need a speaker there? I don't know. There's so many of these. People better love peacocks. They better love them. 
I thought I had. Okay. Oh, dear. But yeah, I'm so excited. We're off to long late today. This is amazing. As I record this, we're off to long late. So, yes. Oh, let's not make that quite so big. Okay. Oh, you overlapping. That's not good. Let's move the little speaker. I don't know whether we need so many speakers, actually. This tree's drawing me crackers. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't think we need so many speakers, actually. I think we're fine. Uh, let's just move this one here, though. That's fine. And then we can probably move this one, like, right to the corner. And then... Cool. Mm -hmm. Oh, right, this one's not even done yet. We probably do need to move that one, actually. Like, boom, there. So people are right in front of it. That's fine. And do we have donation boxes everywhere? I don't think we do. This is crazy. So now what we need is them to have some toys and stuff. Like, oh, gosh, sorry, guys. I've been sat down for what it feels like a long time. Like, toys right near these boards and stuff. So then they do come over to the education boards. Whatever. I already have a sprink one sprinkler, I think. Let's put another one in, like, maybe just here. Cool. Let's go to vet research. Let's see where we're at. We are doing so well, though. My money is flying. Flying. Hmm. Yeah, we need more staff rooms. That's what we need. Um, we do also need vet research on the Indian pea file, so that'll be great. Uh, let's get a staff room and just pop it here. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully that'll work. Okay, we have two. That was very greedy, but we have two. Fabulous. Okay. Let's get some more food. Th do we need any more food things? We probably need toilets. Should I charge people to use the loo? No. Terrible. Terrible. What do I need to do? Put some benches in. Put another couple of benches in here. Like that. Cool. So people can go and sit down or whatever. We are low on cash. Yes, I know this. We have an information center already. Uh, let's go loony balloons. Everyone wants loony balloons, right? Cool, and then, um, I mean, that might have been a waste of funds, but we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Okay. Okay, well, people are coming down here. They do have, like, a place to eat and stuff like that, so that's cool. Let's, where am I going to build my next enclosure, actually? Maybe round here-ish. So what I could do, actually, which would might be good planning, is to go habitat... And then I think we need more spiders or something in. Maybe we could put something down here, actually. Actually, let's see if they've bred any more. I'm sure they have. Has anybody bred anything yet? Oh my goodness, the peafowl already had babies. Oh man, they're going to breed so quick. They're going to breed so quick. Yes, the frogs have had babies. Uh, let's quick trade. For 200 pound. Okay, that's fine. Ooh. Uh, why is that not going there? Well, that'll fit there, but it won't fit down there. Oh, okay. Well, I don't know. Uh, yeah, we could always put, like, another path going along here. That's actually not a bad idea. Uh, keep going down here. Let's see. Let's see if we can just get another little animal, small animal exhibit. Oh, we have no money. <laughs> That's my idea out the window, then. Yeah, so I'm thinking let's get some seats here and then we can have another enclosure here. Let's see what animals I can afford or slash can't afford. Whoops. <laughs> let's get any species just to get some inspiration. What should we put in? I wouldn't mind these actually. Let's just go Zoopedia. I've not really had these much. Um, so it'd be kind of fun to have these, I think. These are, what are they called? Chinese pat... I can never say it. Pagolian. Did I say it? So, how many can we have? I think you can only have, like, one. Up to three males, up to three females. Okay, we could have uh, one male and two female, then. We could do that. I don't know how easy they breed. I have no idea. But we, let's, let's buy these guys. They don't take up much room. I think it'd be fun. 
Let's give them a little, little, uh, let's give them a little wooden enclosure here. Oh! Uh, I kind of want them even. Hang on. You guys know I'm, like, funny with my enclosures. Okay, cool. Uh, let's just align to grid a second, because if it's not straight, it will annoy me. Yeah, I think that's enough, actually. Let's align to grid. I think that as a decent grid. Oh, that's going to annoy me. Oh, that actually works. Okay. Yeah, I think this is enough space. That's actually quite a lot of space for them. They don't take up much room. Let's just see the thing. Yeah, you drink profits. That's good. Zoo reputation needs to get to two star. <laughs> Come on, guys. The race to two stars. That's what we're doing today. That's what we're doing. Okay. Ooh, there's a bit of more of a curve here. Okay. Let's just make this tiny bit like that and then... Cool. Okay. That tiny little corner is really going to annoy me, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Where's the nearest star facility? Oh yeah, let's put that there. And then what we'll do is we'll just get another staff path and we'll just pop it kind of... There-ish? Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Let's take away so much size on it. Okay, cool. Okay, that's cool. It kind of links through there. Wonderful. We could have another link, actually, from this staff here to kind of there as well. Make it look a bit tidier somehow, though. Yeah, because otherwise we're not going to be able to fit an enclosure there. We could, I kind of, that's kind of my plan. We could put something small there, you see. That's really wonky. That's annoying me. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's go along here for a bit. Ooh, obstructed. Okay. That's not great. Okay, let's go staff path and let's just fit you in somewhere. Deselect it. That's fine. I'll do. Great. I have like that one tiny bit of staff bath. Why did I do that? Okay, that's fine. Ooh, okay, let's go to this. We are putting in the Chinese little guy. Chinese Patagonia, which is really cute. So where are my animals? Because I bought them. I did buy them, did I not? Am I losing my mind? Right, let's get one of these. That doesn't look great, does it? Let's go. Let's have a look, see what other things I've got. Chinese doodah. Oh, there's literally just one. Maybe we should... Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. What other small animals are there? I kind of like the small ones. They look cute. They are cute. Okay. Let's go through our animal species and just see. So, aardvark would be a good option. Well, there's none of those. Um, aardvark. Uh, we have a tortoise. We could have... Lemurs would be great. A bonobo would be great. An orangutan would be great. I'm probably being very ambitious. I just kind of want to stay away from the savannah stuff at the moment just because I feel like I, I did those to death. A gallari, I don't know how to say it. They're very cool, actually. They breed really well. Uh, Peafowl have got... I wouldn't. I don't really want the monkeys, but if we, if we have them, then we can get them. Red panda would be cool. Ruff, ruffled lemur. Ring-tailed lemur, maybe. Could put some crocodiles in. If we were stuck. Um, I don't know how much space I have down there, actually. And who else could I fit in? Just see if the monkeys are about, like, the great apes and stuff. See if the leopard is about as well, maybe. Or even a hyena. Okay, okay. This is looking a little bit more hopeful. Let's just see how much space I have here. 800. Hmm. It's not the biggest. Oh, I did actually buy this in the end. Eh. Okay. Really hard to find enough animals. I'm going to quickly buy the aardvark, I think. Because then at least I have them in storage. Oh, look at the red panda. But I don't know if there's a male red panda anywhere. We could have tortoises again. We could put more tortoises in. I think let's buy this ruffled lemur. Let's buy this lemur. Let's buy this tortoise, that tortoise. Should we just put more tortoises in? Just for now. And then hopefully we'll get more money and then we can we can get even more animals in. Because there aren't like a load of animals. That's kind of the point of challenge mode, right? Let's put those three tortoises in then. 
I hope they've got enough space, actually. Cool. Okay, uh, where are the viewing points for these little guys? So let's, let's edit the barrier. Where are we going to put all the viewing stuff? So let's put uh, the glass and things. I mean, it could go all the way around, but they do get a little bit... What's the word? Privacy? Privacy thing? Yeah, they get a little bit, like, upset. Uh, okay, well, let's just... Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Then we're going to put an animal talking point in. I like glass on there, please. Okay. This is great. Who has faith in me? Who reckons we're going to do this today? I do also want to put an exhibit enclosure, like, down here as well at some point. That's probably our next job. Ah, oh, okay. Right. Where did tortoises at? Oh, low on cash. Vet research is complete, though, so that's great. Yay, we have a little bit for our peacock appaloosa. Peacock appaloosa. That's from playing my other games, because I said peacock. My goodness. You guys were going to laugh at that. Oh, okay. Should we get another vet? And then we can up our research. I think maybe we should. Who's about to have offspring? Of course it's the peafowl. Who else would it be? Okay, woohoo, we've got tortoises. Okay, let's sort these guys out. So, we want sh whoop, short grass. Whee, let's in increase that intensity a little bit. Oh, have I got soil here? What short grass? Let's just up this. Put, look, let's put all the short grass in. Then we can sort that out. Let's put a tiny smidge along. Uh, then we can put some sand in all the front here. Oh, I want the other sand. The other sand actually looks really nice. Cool. Uh, that was very intense. Um, <laughs> let's just dot some grass within that. Let's just do that. Okay. Uh, they do need lots of stuff. So let's get cracking. Let's make the... Oh, that wasn't quite right with the terrain. We need less short grass. Maybe stick a bit of rock in. Okay. That'll do. Let's put a teeny weeny... Let's see how much ground and space they have. Are they happy? I don't know how I know. Okay, they've got loads of space. Brilliant. I'm gonna make a tiny, a tiny. Actually, where's the water fit? It doesn't. So I won't put any water in here. Then I'm gonna just give them a drink thingy instead. Let's put an animal talking point there to remind myself that that is what that space is there for. Okie dokie. Let's sort these guys out. Let's go habitat. Let's go. Okay. Put some herb thingies in. Let's put some. We don't need pea fowl. We need. Let's go. It's a Galapagos tortoise. The Galapagos tortoise. Where is it? There it is. Okay. Okay, let's put in a sprinkler here and a sprinkler there. And we need water. We need a water thingy. Let's put a water doodah in there. And we need some food. So the food, let's put in some food troughs. Let's put like loads of little ones everywhere. So let's put, uh, let's put one here, one here, one here, and then maybe one right in the middle because they will, in fact, get a bit annoyed if they can't get to their food quickly. They have so many toys, it's crazy. Let's put a big fat hard shelter in for the back. Ooh, there's nothing for Galapagos Dodders in the hard shelter. Okay, well, let's make this up. Oh, let's put a giant one in. Put a giant one in. We could put this one in. They're really sweet, aren't they? I like putting all little ones in. I think it's kind of cute. Like a little shelter thing here. Um, and then we can put in maybe a giant one. Oh, I don't know. I don't know whether I like that, actually. Let's put in a side one. Okay. Yeah, we'll do all this. That's cool. We've got little beddings here. Oh, no. Diseased animal. It's going to be a peafowl. Clearly. Let's put this one in instead. Cool. Okay. Oh, let's move this ball. Oh, dear. That's floating. That's not a good idea.
Oh no, disease is now life threatening. What? Well, where's my vet? Okay, yeah, I need a new vet. I need more vets. This is a nightmare. And you need to go on there. Okay, quick, let's get some vets in. <gasps> okay. I'm so happy. Let's get two vets. Quick, quickly. Okay. Wow. Wowzer. Okay, we need some habitat stuff for these guys. That was close. Woohoo! Okay. We need rocks and stuff because you know guys know I love I love rocks. Let's put some tropical rocks in. Um, yeah, I don't want all this. What's it doing? Tropical rock. It's like a grand canyon of rocks. There we go. I like this. I like my little stone thing. Okay, let's just move the food tray thing. Because that's got squished. Back to habitat. Let's see what we can do. Put some mossy rocks like in the middle. mossy rock we could just like filter that in somehow so actually looks quite nice yeah a bit, of, bit of mixture in there cool let's put more rocks in i love rocks just putting different rocks in does actually make the difference i think it looks really nice yeah so he can like walk over these little rocks that's really sweet i just wonder if i could like make make like a little thing here Cool. Okay, like some rocks in there. That looks quite nice. And we now just need bushes and trees and stuff. Which do look really cool, to be fair. Serious injury discovered. What? Well, cool of it. Why? What's wrong? Oh, little tortoise. Can you get off there, okay? I think you should be able to get off there, okay? Oh! It's already getting stressful. We are on the race though to, we're on a race to try, <laughs> try and sort these guys out. Oh no, look at the terrain, it's not great. Long, we need like, there's not enough long grass now. Oh, for goodness sake. Whee! Okay, that'll do. Let's just type in the Galapagos again. Let's see where we're at with that. Hmm. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm sure I'll be fine. We just want nature, that's what we want. Like big trees, that kind of thing. Put some palm trees in. Oh, these ones are so pretty. Look at this. That tortoise, I've just put a plant on him. Sorry, mate. Sorry, mate. Okay, it's only calope tree, elephant tree thing. Yay, big bush thing. I love the strangler tree. I think the strangler tree always looks so nice. We'll put that right there and then we can put another strangler tree. Maybe a different type of strangler tree. In. Oh yeah, that's great. That's actually tamarind tree I think I've accidentally put in there. Let's put another strangler tree. We can give them like proper Swiss cheese. Is this a Swiss cheese plant? That's really funny. I love that it's called a Swiss cheese plant. Okay, this is cool. I love Planet Zoo. Oh, Wimba tree. A Wimba way, a Wimba way, a Wimba way, a Wimba way. We need donation boxes a bit quick. Oh my goodness, and conservation boards. Guys, I'm so hungry. My stomach's going. I'm so sorry. I'm so hungry. You're going to hear my stomach. It's literally going crazy. Okay. But guys, if you have faith in me to complete this zoo then let me know in the comment section below Woo! okay let's that fitted perfectly one two uh let's run some animals through through that cool i mean probably need another educator or two cool let's put conservation boards up and we do need some information stuff as well which i probably could go around and just do now but hey 
This is crazy. I feel like this we've done loads this episode, but it's going to start getting quite fiddly the game. So bear with me, guys. Yeah, we'll get really fiddly. Because uh, loads of things will start to go wrong and stuff like that. Uh, let's put some boards in as well, wherever they're at. Oh, this is so crazy. Okay, right. Okie dokie, let's put that in. I don't know how many Galapagos tortoises we could have in one go, actually. I don't know, but I'm glad we managed to get loads. Hey, tickets are underpriced again. That's good. It means our zoo's going up, guys. The race to five stars. We're going to do it. We're going to do it. My goodness. The race to five stars in challenge mode. Oh, I don't know whether I need it quite that big. Maybe I'll move this little speaker over. Cool. It's just very fiddly, you know. So we're just going to put in all this information here. <gasps> okay, it's so tiring. And whoop. And then... Hopefully, that'll be fine. We still need donation boxes. Why did they... I swear I put them in. Am I going mad? Yes, you are mad. Uh, no. Yeah, that doesn't look too bad. I think that's kind of cool, actually. Habitat has damaged barriers. Great. Maybe we need to get another mechanic in as well. We have grown this zoo very quick, to be fair. Um... Let's get a couple of other security guys as well, because that's going to start getting silly, I reckon. Facilities broken. Mechanic security vendor, veterinarian, educator. Let's get another couple of caretakers as well. Because let's face it, people are going to be grabbing... Oh, look, someone's knocked my bin over. <gasps> you know you know how precious I am about my bins. Okay, good. People are starting to congregate down here for stuff, so that's great. Let's put in some more drink and food stands and stuff like that down here. Let's do that. We do need toilets, actually. Where am I going to put those? Um, did I have space over here for them? Yeah, just behind here we could put those toilets in, couldn't we? Let's do that. And let's get some more drink and food things down here. We could put some toilets in, to be fair. I think that's probably enough food and drink stuff down here. We could put a goopy soda in again, just there. Because that is what gets busy. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, my goodness. I'm really happy with this today. This is so fun. So, we've got some tortoises. And we've put the peacocks in. So, we've put peacocks and tortoises in today. So, that's that's highly successful. And we're now at nearly, 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 nearly two star. Um, we need to somehow get that up. Maybe we could put some marketing out there. I don't know if I can afford marketing. But let's go to finances. Let's go to marketing. We could just put a print poster one. For a year. Hopefully that will boost us a little bit. Zoo reputation. Yeah, we got to two stars. What a great way to finish episode two on two stars. Yay. Cool. Okay, guys. That was that was awesome. I think that's it for today. But if you guys want to follow my progress with this, then please subscribe. Turn on that notification bell. And if you've enjoyed today's video and you want to see more of this content, then please smash that like button. I'd really appreciate it. What goes in next? Do we do a huge savannah thing? Or do we put some wolves or something like that in? Maybe you can start getting some predators. We could have like a predator corner or something like that. Yeah. We need some more plants. We're going to like rainforest this all out, I think, and make it look really cool. Maybe get some exhibit animals down here that will hopefully breed us some really cool stuff. I don't know. I'm really happy with this so far. I feel like it's going really well. Thanks, guys, so much for watching. Have a awesome rest of your day. Or should I, should I say a wild rest of your day? Yeah, and I'll see you very soon. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.